give all praises, glory, and honor to Yahweh, Bashem, Yahweh Shai, Bashem, Rakakadash. Double honors to our apostles and elders of Great Millstone. And peace and salutations to your brothers uh, teaching this word out there in truth and sincerity and in faith. Uh, this is the brother again. I want, I want to do a quick video on, um, you know, chemtrails, all right? This is something over uh, the Bay Area in uh, October, and trust me, this is a very common sight here uh, in, the, in the area where we live, all right? <clears throat> and uh, the reason why I want to go into chemtrails is because I saw an article. I wanted to bring it out. Okay, this is from StopSprayingGuys.com. It says, exposing the global chemtrail geoengineering program. Okay. This is an analytical report by Campbell Analytical. Right. This is done on, uh, the project was done on the most recent rainstorm. So this is uh, on the 20th of March. Today is April the 3rd, by the way. It says here. Right, they found aluminum, barium, iron, titanium, and sulfur. Right, these are all, you know, the heavy metals, right, that cause cancer and disease found in the air that you're breathing, right? This is a San Francisco rain test positive for aluminum, barium, titanium, iron, and sulfur. Again, <laughs> so this is something they always find, right? Uh, rainwater collected in San Francisco tested positive for five elements proposed to be sprayed on us by geoengineer David Keith and others. So this is certified laboratory. They found aluminum, barium, titanium, iron. All right, and the so the proof is right here. All right, I'm gonna go into some scriptures. Okay, this is a Revelation 11 and 18. And the nations were angry, and their wrath is come, and the time of the dead, that they should be judged, and that thou shouldest give reward unto the servants thy prophets, unto the, thy servants the prophets, and to the saints, and to them that fear thy name, small and great, and shouldest destroy them, which destroy the earth, all right? And who else could that be? All right, who, who has the power to be jumping up in these airplanes and, and, and just be spraying chemtrails, you know? This is clear as day. You know, that should piss you off, you know? Because I, I was, you know, it was raining a lot here and then it was sunny. And, you know, people think, that, oh man, my allergies are attacking me because it's sunny, but really it's because the white man's spraying, spraying up with diseases on you, all right? Being the devil. Not only is he, is he killing you people on the ground, he's destroying the, uh, he's destroying the entire, entire ecosystem, okay? All right, because this gets in the water, and you drink that water, the animals are drinking it. Okay, it's going in the, the, the soil, contaminating the soil, which goes into the plants, and you eat the plants, and the animals eat the plants. It's a never-ending cycle of death brought to you by none other than the so-called white man, right? Especially delivered unto you by the so-called white man. This is a Proverbs 29 and 2. When the righteous are in authority, the people rejoice. But when the, when the wicked beareth rule, the people mourn. Yeah, that's why you have sites called Stop Spraying Us. All right, because people are mad. People that actually understand what these these things in the sky are not natural, okay? These aren't vapor trails. All right, the, these are actual chemicals being trailed out of an airplane for it to uh, you know, dissipate into to the atmosphere to fall onto you people, right? To kill you. Because right? the, the so-called white man, right? His whole goal in life, the whole reason why he has technology, why he he advanced his civilization, so to speak, is to make it more efficient 
killing and enslaving people, right? That's the whole reason why he uses his technology, right? To find better ways to be the devil, right? That's, that's how he operates. This is a Job. Uh, oh, it's a lot. Let me get this one. This is Psalms 2 and 1. Why do the heathen rage and the people imagine a vain thing? Right? Because the heathen, the rage of these people, they, you know, they don't believe in the kingdom. They don't see what's going on. Because okay, here it is. The white man is in power and he's destroying the earth. Okay, he's raging. He's a raging idiot, a raging, violent homosexual. And all you Edomites, all right, uh, y'all going crazy right now, all right? Hey, right now, this is breaking news here in uh, the Bay at, at YouTube, all right? The shooter dead, at least four injured in YouTube mass shooting. Okay, so to the woman shot multiple people Tuesday at YouTube's headquarters in San Bruno, according to the police. Sources tell Crawford that a woman shot and killed her boyfriend. The shooter is believed to be dead from self-inflicted gunshot wound. Right? There are at least four victims being treated at the hospital. You know, why is this happening? Because people are bugged out. The police, police chief Barberini called it a very chaotic scene. Right? Ordo F. K. O. And, you know, this is what's happening right now. People are going into the YouTube and shooting it up, shooting people that they, <laughs> and shooting other people, and then, then taking their own lives. Was just briefed on the shooting at YouTube's headquarters, San Bruno. All right, of course, this is Trump, piece of shit. And he had nothing to, he had nothing to say about the cop shooting at that Jake Stephen Clark. All right, and as you can see, YouTube headquarters is right here, smack dab in the bay. You know. Okay, and 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 you see this whole area, the Bay Area has a special special spirit on it, man. You got these people catching them, pure hell, their quality of life it, it is drastically. Uh, 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 it's not improving, right? It's getting worse. The quality of life, meaning infrastructure, traffic, schools, everything's going down, right? The uh, housing is going up. Expenses is going up. Groceries is going up. Gas is going up. And all the while that's happening, your wages stay the same. I'm speaking about you poor people, you lower middle class people. Your purchasing power is drastically declining every year. All right, let me read this again. When the righteous are in authority, the people rejoice. But when the wicked bear through the people mourn, yeah, these people are mourning. Yeah, YouTube, man. And then YouTube, you devils, right? You've been taking down our channels and all this other BS. Now look at you. You're catching them but hell, right? You shouldn't be messing with the Most High's men, the prophets, right? Hey, what does the scripture say? Let me get this. This is an axe. This is Acts 5 and 38. And now I say unto you, refrain from these men. Let them alone. All right? For if this counsel or this work be of men, it will come to naught. Yeah. Why are you two? Why, why are you bugging us, man? Why are, you, why are you bugging us? All right? Why are you taking down our channels? What did we do? He took the brother Manatazak's channel down. He had all them beautiful videos, Hollywood productions. All right? Uh, he took the apostles pages down for a second you're suspending the brother the elder brother y'all calls channels all right and, and and for what all you're doing is proving that the most high is dealing with us man and the, and the most high is not dealing with you all right where is this at it says and now i say unto you refrain from these men and let them alone for if this counsel or this work be of men it will come to naught but if it be of the most high ye cannot overthrow it as happily you be found even to fight against the Most High. Yeah, that's that's the spirit you so-called so-called white people come into, right? You're fighting against the Most High. That's why you're spraying chemtrails in the sky, right? That's why YouTube is getting shot up. None but bug outs work for YouTube, anyways. None but pure pure blooded bug outs. All right. And uh, yeah, I wanted to bring out this preset. This way.
All right, it says, The wicked man travaileth with pain all his days. This is Job 15 to 20. And the number of years is hidden to the oppressor. All right? Yeah, the oppressor, he don't know how long he got. Hey, but the way hey, we go to Job, right? The wicked know if he got a short time. And then also in Revelation, all right? 12 and 12. All right? Hey, the, the triumphing, the wicked is short. You devils are done, okay? A dreadful sound is in his ears, and prosperity the destroyer shall come upon him. Yeah, who's the destroyer? That's the most high. All right? He believeth not that he shall return out of darkness, and he is waited for of the sword. <laughs> That's right. Yeah, he believeth not that he shall return out of darkness. All right? He he doesn't have hope. Okay, he's stuck there. And he, he knows that there's only one thing coming for him, man. And that's the sword. That's destruction. And that's how the two-thirds are. That's how all the wicked are. The two-thirds. But especially you so-called white people, man. You say it in your jokes. Oh, yeah, man. If I go to the future, oh, man, I'm gonna, our, us white people are fucked. We're fucked in the future. Because they know, man. These other nations, the Israelites, the people get that power, man. It's going to roll up on you, man. All right, when the people get the nuclear missiles ready to go, they're going to blast it on this place. All right? He wandereth abroad for bread, saying, Where is it? He knoweth that the day of darkness is ready at his hand. <laughs> yeah, man. Now this devil's going everywhere, man, trying to, trying to get this bread. All right? Because he knows, man, that the day of darkness is coming. Trouble and anguish shall make him afraid. They shall prevail against him. As a king ready to the battle, where he stretches out his hand against the Most High and strengthens himself against the Almighty. All right? That's exactly what you're doing. Okay? You're stretching out your hand against the Heavenly Father. You're trying to take down the channels. You're destroying all the Most High's creations. All right? And the Most High, he isn't with it. Okay? He, he doesn't, he doesn't uh, appreciate the wickedness of you so-called white people. Okay? Yeah, although he created you as such, that don't mean a damn thing. You still got to go into slavery. Okay? Uh, let me bring this up. This is uh, Isaiah 29 and 15. Woe unto them that seek deep to hide their counsel from the Lord, and their works are in the dark. And they say, who seeth this? Who knoweth this? Yeah, because, you know, Right now, we're bringing out all these things in the dark, okay? We're bringing out the truth. We're bringing it to light. And you devils are trying to take it down. Uh, what's this YouTube? Yeah, you devils, you devils are, all right. At YouTube, you want to take take it down, man. But the spirit of the most size is putting hell on these people, man. Because in, in this YouTube headquarters, they used to know people who used to work here. You know, uh, they're low. They got low. It's a low-level job, man. I'm talking about people that got to review the flags. You know, it's a sick job. They, they see some sick shit. And then here it is. They're, they're watching all kinds of sick videos. They got to delete. And then they have to stumble across the Israelites. And then they got to sit there. They got to watch the Israelites. So chances are, you know, they seen the Israelites. They got condemned. And now the Mosai sent a death angel on them. <laughs> right? And I know this because I know people that used to work in uh, YouTube, and they, that was their job. They had to look at the flag videos, they had to review, review reports, check out the video, delete it, report it to the higher ups, right? Then they, then they have to, so then they, they stumble over what? The Israelites. And, and what ends up happening? You end up getting condemned. Okay, because we're at the end of America, we're at the end of this place, right? We're at the very last moments. Of Babylon, right? Because the truth is coming out, and, and you can see everything you're trying to do is stop the truth. So you, you, all you devils can do, right, is either kill yourself, kill other people with you, kill yourself, all right, and, and try to go hard and kill the Israelites. You know, that's all you can do. There's, there's nothing else you devils can do. All right. And with that, I want to give all praises, glory, and honor to Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai. All right. And death to America.